And bam, we are going three for three with vlogs this week, but that's just because so many things are happening. Yanni has the G-Wagon. And literally, the only means of transportation that I have is this. <laughs> so, I needed to get a car ASAP yep. to like be able to get around. And we all know the best family car in the world is an Audi. Sound, I missed it. Mm. With cars, I'm very like, this is what I want. With the R6, I was kind of like, which one should I get? Like, stock or not stock, but then again, I'm not a stock person, so then I was like, we gotta say, I'm doing some personal meditation here. <laughs> Normally, I would have like changed more things than standard and you know black wheels I'm a, I'm a sucker for black wheels but here is the new you <laughs> who is like trying to be okay with these wheels at least for two two days two days and then they're gonna go black because you need black or six wheels This time I haven't had a Ferita exhaust on it. So it's Ferita exhaust uh, downpipes, 800-ish. So I think it's maybe actually more than the last one I had. I remember it was enough, but. <laughs> See, this is what I try to look for when buying a car. A used car that feels new. Because yes. then you avoided that, like, I mean, it's got... What is used here? <laughs> like a few hundred, a few thousand kilometers, but just, ah, look. Welcome, Jun Olsen. Oi, oi, oi. <laughs> Matte carbon package. Alcantara steering wheel. Yeah. What do you think, Warner? Do you recognize me again on my back? <laughs> for sure. So, I'm curious, how many of these have you had? Well, one that was really rebuilt, so that, call it two versions, that burned, and then another one, that, is it only three? This is four. That's probably four then. Because <laughs> you keep so this is the fourth. I don't know, fifth. fourth or fifth. But I love this color, this gray is sick, actually. Yeah. I've like always loved this Audi gray for the last two years. Like, I mean, you gotta get milk in something. So, all right, on a normal day, what? <laughs> on a normal day, you have this, you have the Phantom, and you have, you know, w both your Porsches. What do you take to get milk? I mean, that's the reason I'm getting this. But <laughs> I'm now a, a father of two living in Sweden. That's why I Rolls Royce Phantom and race Porsches. Hey, and the Lancia. <laughs> wow, it looks like brand new. It looks I know. That was, it was the right choice. We spent a lot of time debating. Yeah. This is like a Rolls Royce Phantom compared to the G backseat. I look like it's so well specced. Did you bring the black spray paint? Yeah, of course. I have them. Okay. <laughs> and uh, <coughs> is it easy to lower it? We can do it with the computer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, not yeah, no, no, no. no not <laughs> <laughs> That's like my two always like panic thing. Black wheels, low car. Let's go to Prova Starta Bilan. Hey, you have your bike. Okay. We're gonna go for a little spin. Go and then we come back. Watch out for the what do you paint. What do you think, Yanni? Super nice. 
Wow. Love the color. Come on, come on, Warner. It's like the true family setup. Uh, Neighbors will even like you. <laughs> That's like so awkward. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, like. I mean, it is the best family wagon. Like, you want to go to Aura, you want to go to Mura, you want to go like do anything. Yeah. It's like a monster in disguise. But see, like, I've been trying to figure out since I got to Sweden, I'm like, I need a car. I've been looking at everything possible. But this, I feel directly when I sit in it. It's, I mean, there's a reason it's my fourth. I'd be interested to see what other people think. What other people think of your favorite cars. Like, what is your favorite car that you, that you and had over the last, like, decade of, like, ridiculousness? Yeah. Comment below. Yeah, comment, comment below. So talk to me about why you picked this one rather than new or other years. Like what made this? Because I looked at every RS6 for sale. I looked at the kilometers. I looked at the price. I looked at stock. I looked at tune uh, at, and colors and spec. Um, at the end, it came down to a combination of the spec that I love because I this gray. It was the same as the boat gray that I have. Um, matte carbon fiber, 360 camera, like the overall spec was really well, um, or really good. And then you had the black um, package on the outside, which is really nice. And then it was already tuned at 800 uh, horsepower. Yeah. I like the idea of buying a tuned car also with low kilometers. And I like the Ferita exhaust. It's um, it's aggressive and mean, yet maybe more suited for me. <laughs> Actually, that was more aggressive than I thought. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> what the actual heck is this? <laughs> Okay, yeah, okay, so we're not tuning anytime soon. Like, I don't need any more than that. That was. Oh, really I forgot how fun that was. Yeah. Okay, I mean, I, I'm back to it. Yeah. I'll say it right now. <laughs> this is the best car ever built. Like, I mean, I could go out in the McLaren, be uncomfortable, like, unpractical and, like, whatnot. And this is just equally fun. But I can go to Aura with all the ski gear. And also, one key aspect that made me look at the RS6 is that if you look at a lot of cars, the Urus, uh, everything around there, uh, the Kudina, like prices have gone cuckoo in the last two years. Uh, even you check the G wagons, what are, since the shortage of cars have made getting new ones difficult, then um, the second hand market has gone crazy. Whereas the RS6 feels like it is where it should be. The only aspect I need is the fact that it's... It's this. <laughs> Forget all the rest I said, like why I got this car. <laughs> that was why. Oh my god. Is it approved? <laughs> yes, it is approved. And it really feels like you're gonna keep this one. Yeah, it feels like it, no? Yeah, it really feels that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah? yeah I really yeah. think so too. Yeah, what do you guys think? Yeah. No, honey knows we're home. <laughs> That it sucks. He doesn't want it. Yeah, yeah change, <laughs> change. Like, can, can can I have it? <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, I kind of just remembered that I think this is the best car in the world. It's like you hit the gas, and it feels like a McLaren. You hit the double, like make it quiet, and it's like Prius. Go yeah. get milk. Thank you for guiding me. No problem. It's my own. Like 
I don't trust, uh, actually I only trust you when it comes to, to like actually get input on which car to buy. So if you want to buy a car, don't, don't be as annoying as I am as a, a customer, but, <laughs> but I'm gonna, we need to put uh, your info in the bottom. Thank you. Because it's hard to find good guidance when buying cars. But it's sick. It is. It's quick. I felt young again. <laughs> I felt alive. <laughs> New you does not do wide body. <laughs> Huh? No. We have Isafix. We're ready to go. Yeah. I'm nervous for a second. <laughs> We're gonna end the vlog here. We're gonna make it short. Um, just wanted to update that we've got a new car. Small changes might be happening. We're gonna try not to. And then, yes, yeah, we said jackets, mm -hmm. magnets, pockets, magnets. And this material is. Uh, if you want to make your life difficult, like three layer, 30,000. You can stand in a waterfall in it. High color, oh. I always like, so. Because yeah. I realized when, last summer when we were in Sweden, I'm out playing in the rain with Leon, and I've got this raincoat on, I'm like, I just, I just hate having that. Yeah, I wanted a jacket that I could use for many different things, like, you know, stand in a waterfall, jump in mud puddles with Leon, go out with the, the boat for a windbreaker, go to the city for dinner, and just you know grab over a hoodie if if too cold for just a hoodie it's as high end of a jacket as, as you can more or less get with the ventilation and then you can also have a belt in oh yeah i saw that yeah if you want to be like if i'd go to the the city I, I might pull off the belt Ooh. but you know just like i've been wearing it all day like actually you know why i'm really slow on this intro <laughs> outro <laughs> I've been flipping logs like we, we've been carrying out dead trees like like all of this was dead and I was carrying from for like eight hours yesterday and I'm like ex honestly I'm like dead yeah I came here that's why my brain's not properly working so with that that that's why this is not the longest of vlogs but there'll be more of this but just you know why I'm like I'm like completely exhausted so we're gonna end the vlog now I'm gonna go rest now you got the, the full truth and, and let's go rest <laughs>